irrespective of the indictment, I, I want the American people to know that I had no right to overturn the election. And then on that day, President Trump asked me to put him over the Constitution. But I chose the Constitution, and I always will. I mean, I, I, uh, I really do believe that uh, anyone who puts themselves over the Constitution should never be President of the United States. And anyone who asks someone else to put themselves over the Constitution should never be President of the United States again. Now, with regard to the substance of the indictment, I've, I've been very clear. I had hoped it wouldn't come to this. I had, I had hoped that uh, uh, this issue and the judgment of the president's actions that day would be left to the American people. Well, I, I, uh, I testified under a subpoena before the grand jury. I'm somebody that believes in the rule of law. But uh, look, I have nothing to hide. Uh, and so my focus is going to be not, not on the indictment or the merits of it. There are profound issues. The president can make his case in court. But I'm going to make it clear to the American people, uh, as I seek the Republican nomination, that despite what Donald Trump has said over the last two and a half years, that I had no right to overturn the election. Thanks, everybody.